And now we see that these celebrities and these athletes and these politicians and these entertainers, nothing more than some damn puppets, some box top puppets. And you worship these minions. I mean, you worship them, you revere them, you argue about them, you fight people that you know over them, and you know, you would get into a, a confrontation over one of these, trying to support and defend these puppets. If somebody say something bad about them, you, all of a sudden you catching feelings and you want to you want to start to uh, try to demean the person that said it and tell them they're nothing. It's like, you need to wake the fuck up, man. It's like, you know, you you are you are a damn puppet now, too, just like the, the puppets that you worship. Because the, the real power that you was given by Mother Nature, the creator of the universe, is the reason why you a puppet. It's the only power that could be used to do something with it. It just so happened that the beings that's doing it is some low down dirty evil beings, some demons. And they they using these people. That's why they got the puppet position because they started out with power. And now they're in a position of a puppet. Perceived power. You, you perceive that they got power, but really they don't. They used to. And then you used to have power until you gave it away to them. You know, it's a way for these demons to kill two birds with one stone. It's like, don't ever try to tell me nothing about these damn puppets. Like, promote them or defend them or, you know, you want to exalt them. And, oh, I worship them. Oh, I'm a fan. And, oh, the, the queen or the king and all this kind of shit. This shit out of here. It's like, this is idol worship. They tell you about this in the puppet script books because that's what they're going to in inflict. That's what they're going to enact. You know, that's the source material behind the schemes that they're running. You know, the show, the show goes on. The show must continue. And one monkey don't stop no show because we got a whole bunch of more monkeys that'll get on here and do some monkey shit for us. And this is how we control the minds of the people with these puppets. You take one puppet and now you can control 10 puppets, 20 puppets, 200 puppets, 2,000 puppets. You understand me? You could take the power... That Mother Nature, the creator of the universe, gave the man and woman. You could trick them. Play mind games with them. You could program them. Okay? <laughs> you can possess them into becoming a puppet. Without them even knowing what the... They, they don't even realize what's going on. They Because now they're a puppet. They don't get it. But everything that they do and everything that they're about is all about being a damn puppet. And it comes back to the foundation of logic. Like, you know, the foundation of logic is knowing who your creator is. Because if you don't know that, everything else that you think you know will only confuse you. You're going to be feeling mixed emotions. You're going to be hurt, sad, happy. You're going to be whatever they want you to be based on the script for the day. Oh, this person, oh, they, be, oh, oh, hey, yeah, look at this. You know, it's it's some corny, fruity, soy boy, soy girl, goy type shit. You see Russell Westbrook coming out with the skirt on. You see, you got to get married to the beast to get a ring. You see, LeBron already did it. He got his. He, now he want to get another one. Well, we're going to get you somebody now that's going to perform the ritual tribute that's going to make it possible for us to go ahead and do that for you. When really, it was going to happen anyway, regardless without that motherfucker. Because it's all a cycle and a synchronicity, but they have these smart dummies thinking that, oh, if I do this, I could get this, and they'll do anything to be on that screen. <laughs> they'll, they'll do anything to become a box star puppet. You mean I'll never have to worry about money no more and I, I could be able to get what I want and all I have to do is bow down and worship and do what you say? Well, hey, man, I, hey, from, I ain't going to live in this world, you know, without being able to 
know that I'm good. I'm good. I got the bag. I got to get that bag. How do young people say? You got to get that bag, huh?